So we are going to go for a bike ride just to stretch our legs, get some fresh air. It is a beautiful it's day. Really nice. Yeah, it's just over 60 degrees. And we are going to go for a bike ride. And no one will be near us. It's perfect for social distancing. We won't <laughs> be near anyone. Then we're taking a soccer ball or a football. And that's what I call it. And we're going to go find a place at the community center where there are no other people and kick the ball around. And then we are going to come home. We went for about a half an hour bike ride and now we're at the community center. There's no one here. So we are going to play soccer with Colby for a little bit and then go home. Colby, play soccer. Colby. Yeah, yeah. Daddy, daddy. There we go. Mommy's wearing, Mommy's wearing. Mama's wearing extremely practical footwear for soccer. Shoes. Whoa, Colby, you're so fast. Kick, kick. You didn't go before, all right. Kick, go get that ball. Keep ahead of your hands. All right, kick it. Kick it over here, Colby. Kick that ball. Good boy. Good kick. Daddy kick. Go get it. Oh, good catch. Okay. Mommy kick. In her appropriate shoes. <laughs> yeah. Run with that ball, Bubba. Daddy catch! Uh oh, go get it, Colby! This is what we needed. We needed some exercise. And there's literally no one here, so it's perfect. And of course, we'll go home, and wash our hands. Alright, don't need to get it. Oh. So, while Tom and Colby are playing soccer, I just wanted to document the sign because hopefully, in my lifetime, I will never have to see signs like this again. Empty parks. Kind of sad because it's a perfect day. And sure, kids would be at school, but I'm sure toddlers would still be playing. So, hopefully, never again in our lifetime. So, we just got back. We had a really nice half hour bike ride. We literally saw like no one um, walk in or anything. We saw a few people on their porches and we shouted hi and they shouted hi. We had quite a few people. Uh, shout out words of encouragement like that's what we should be doing but we literally could cycle in the middle of the road and it was absolutely wonderful and then we went to the uh, community center it was kind of hard to keep Colby off the park but we're trying not to use the park the duck. but we did play soccer we played it on the grass and we played it um, oh, someone just like a past our house. That's great. We played soccer on the grass and we played it on the, the concrete and it was really lovely to be out. And again, we didn't see anyone. It was completely quiet. And now we're home. We're going to make lunch. It is so nice outside. We're going to have uh, lunch under our new awning and uh, see what the afternoon brings. We got the awning up. Colby is already nearly finished with his food. He's going to have a, one of the muffins we made in just a minute. And we are enjoying being under our new awning, which you want more, you always want more, which is providing perfect shade. So I want to show you our kind of ghetto home outdoor, hey Colby, outdoor cinema. We have the laptop, we have it connected via Bluetooth to the speaker, and uh, we're watching the dark side of the ring. It's a wrestling documentary and eating lunch and it's just perfect under our new awning. I cannot imagine how hard it is for people that don't have a backyard right now with children. So the other day Tom decided he wanted to have a serving tray so he used this crate and he attached it and in there is our kitchen you can see from not see Tom because it's like dark in there but there's our kitchen there he is there's our kitchen so now we have a little oh I undid it a little bit of a if I mend it a serving tray oh and I did the other side 
Oops. Well, it looks like I can't do it in film. But anyway, there's our serving tray. Being so you're not, ghetto. You've been very ghetto. Why aren't you putting the grate across? I, there's no need to. I just, it, it's already in there. How long do you think it's gonna? So I finally am off the amoxicillin, off the antibiotics. My strep throat is all cleared up, and now I can have a glass of wine. So I'm having a Chardonnay in the glass I made for our St. Patrick's Day party that obviously couldn't happen. I have Chardonnay and some pink lemonade. And uh, a little too zoomed in. Let me zoom out. And uh, cheers. It's good to be an adult. <laughs> Kobe, what are you making? A tunnel. A tunnel? Who's going to use the tunnel? Is it Choo Choo Thomas going to use the tunnel? Yes. Yes. Good digging. A Choo Choo the house. A Thomas that's in the house, that big Thomas? Oh, it's going to have to be a big, big, big tunnel. A big, big tunnel. A big, big tunnel to the house? No. Keep going. Might take you a while at this rate. While we eat, we're gonna jump on the bandwagon and we're gonna watch the Tiger King Murder, Mame and Madness series on Netflix. Cobby, you wanna watch Tiger King? No. No? Uh, no. What do you want to watch? You know, there's not every day. You wanna watch? Oh, you do wanna watch the Tigers? Yes, cause there's, oh, I don't know what that is. Oh, no, no one wanna watch this. What do you wanna watch? Uh, Peppa Pig. Peppa Pig. Do you think we're going to watch Peppa Pig? Hi, please. I know. I love you.